friends, it's Emmy. Welcome back to my channel. Today is a day that I have been looking forward to for so long. We're decorating the kitchen for Christmas. This is part two of my Christmas Decorate With Me little series. If you missed part one, I will link that below so you can check it out. We decorated the living room and the entryway. And today we are decking out our newly renovated kitchen that we just finished like yesterday. And then I also decorated the porch, took some clips of that for you guys to see. But seriously, I am so excited for the star of the show, the kitchen. I can't wait, I have all of my goodies out here on our kitchen island and yeah why don't we just jump straight into it just wanted to give a quick brief overview of all of the goodies that we're working with we've got quite a few fun things to play around with up here and i think it's gonna turn out so adorable Since the island is kind of acting as our decor holder, I think we're gonna start over here on the countertops, kind of work our way around, and then probably finish with the island. And the island is what I'm most excited to decorate, but let's start right over here. I'm going back and forth as to whether I want to, A, please hold. I don't know whether I want to put my pink KitchenAid, which I'm so excited about, over here or if I want to do my little hot chocolate bar over here. Both things need to find a spot somewhere on the counter, but I don't know which spot I want which thing. But you guys, when I tell you that I have been waiting to put this out for literal months, I truly have. And it matches my outfit today, so it's even more fun. But how cute is this? And we have a decorative bowl to put in it somewhere, like a white ceramic one. Might see if I can find that. It's probably in our storage room somewhere, which is hard to go through right now. So we'll see, but oh, I love this. This is a very happy day. Let's go outside. The snow is falling down and every child is having so much fun. The snowman is twice the size as me with a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm while we stand And watch a choir perform and all the I did a little reconfiguring and I think this is the move I love that it just looks like the star of the show surrounded by all the cute little trees We're moving on over to the sink area over here Nothing too crazy, but I do have a few Christmas touches I want to add. I got a Christmas dish soap that I'll set out. And then um, this will be out year round, but I had to show you guys this. I just love this little scrubbing brush with the cute pink little accent. Love that. So that will go here. And then we have this little tub of dish cloths. This is from Anthropology. Um, it was a wedding shower gift, but they're just super nice little dish towels that you can pull out and use and I think it looks super cute so I love that but let's decorate the sink be with you cause God knows that I've been longing for ya I just wanna hold you close you know the stars are shining just for you let's take a walk and we can follow the moon let's till we reach a place we can stay maybe kiss a bit and dream away and in a while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you I forgot about a major, major staple piece in the kitchen And it is this wreath from World Market I love it, I think it's so pretty, it looks very realistic But I want to hang it here on the kitchen window. I thought it would be such a pretty touch and I think I'm gonna string um, a strand of twinkle lights through it so that it lights up and I think it's gonna be, oh, I think it's gonna be beautiful. And in a while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire. Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy Love and so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe Baby with you With you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you With you mm -hmm. So beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe Baby with you with 
so far and we're gonna move over into this little corner. So I wanna do a hot cocoa bar in this corner for sure. And then there's some other pieces that I have that I'm not sure where their home is gonna be. So they may or may not end up somewhere in this vicinity. We're kind of running out of counter space and it's totally fine if not all of this stuff you know, fits on our counters. I don't want it to look mumbled and jumbled, but if it looks cute, then why not put it there, right? So we'll play around with this. Hot cocoa bar for sure happening, and then we'll see what else. Well, I'm all for Christmas. All the happy smiles and the wishes. And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe Tell me one thing Is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow Whatever we do, we will be alright these holiday wonders will open your mind Make Okay, I got the corner situated how I want it and now we're gonna move over to the little stove top area and this little nook beside the fridge um, Obviously don't want to go crazy on the stove top. We use it all the time So we're gonna keep it pretty practical over here, and then I have a bunch of utensils that we're gonna pop into a cute little utensil holder and stick it over here. Cookbooks, maybe put the little gingerbread house over here. Just play around with it and see what looks cute. But again, don't wanna do anything too chaotic because it is our stove top and I wanna keep it clear. Also, it's totally not Christmas, but how fun is this pink Himalayan salt grinder? I mean, another pop of pink and it's like, it's salt, it's pink salt. That's fun. The dream I knew. Well, I'm all for Christmas. It's a magical time full of kisses. Take a walk outside and tickle the snowman's nose. Something from the chimney I will keep you warm As soon as you remove that snow Oh, whatever we do We will be alright These holiday wonders Will open your mind May all your wishes tonight come true The love I live The dream I knew Christmas, I only want to be close to you. The time has come for the main event. It's time to decorate the island. Um, so we have candlesticks. We have these two different kinds of taper candles. Love both of them. I'll probably mix. Um, we have these ceramic little pink trees. And then what I'm super excited about is these placemats that we're actually gonna repurpose from our wedding. We did these at the head table, but they're like pine, Christmassy looking placemats. And I'm gonna do these and then use some of our nice plates and bowls and um, make really cute little place settings with these cuties. So I'm very excited about this. I think it's gonna turn out adorable. Uh, let's get to it. This is really the last thing in the kitchen, I think. It's cold outside, but the fire keeps us warm. We can spend the night underneath the mistletoe. And I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. The snow is falling down, and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're around, everything will be okay. Cause all I wanna do is spend this holiday with you. 
We're gonna give the porch its little Christmas makeover. If you have been around a few months ago now, I guess I think we did it in September. So a couple months ago, we did the porch for fall. I wasn't sure if I wanted to do it or not at that point because um, we haven't really done any of the exterior remodel. We wanna paint and do a few things on the outside of the house. So I wasn't sure if I wanted to do it, but I ended up doing it and loved it. It just <laughs> brought me so much happiness. So we're gonna do it for Christmas as well. I don't have a ton of stuff that I plan on putting out here, but I think it's gonna turn out really cute. And I'm actually repurposing a ton of the things that I'm using from our wedding. So that's great. I didn't have to buy a lot and we already had it just sitting in our basement. You can probably see there are a bunch of water stains on the concrete right now. Our pumpkins left like little pumpkin rings underneath of them, so I had to do some scrubbing. I don't really think they came off, so we might have to like hide those rings with other decor pieces because they really don't look very pretty. Why don't I show you some of the things that we picked up for the porch um, that we're gonna use. Here is the stash. My favorite thing for out here is this front door mat. We're like really into Christmas, which is so true. And I thought this mat was hilarious. It actually just came in today. I'm super excited. Um, I have this bundle of birch logs. We'll see if we use that out here. I'm not 100% sure. This is our front door wreath and I'm low key obsessed with it. I love the jingle bells. It's from the Hearth and Hand collection um, by Magnolia at Target. Absolutely love it, thought it was super cute. And we have these two trees that I got from Hobby Lobby. Also have this huge bundle of these like glass ornament strands. I don't know if I can hang them out here because I think since they're glass, they would probably break. But what I might do is, I might take these mini wreaths and candles out here and stuff these lanterns with the glass ornament balls and possibly some lights. There's my coat laying on the ground because it's actually really hot out here. This rug will get reused underneath. And then we also have two big wooden pallets that I might flip upside down and use to make like some levels. And then this is just a bag of lights. And this is like a box of string lights from our wedding. And these might go in the lanterns as well, but. That's it. I'm just gonna jump right in and start at the front door. It's what I'm most excited about and I think it's gonna be super cute. So we're gonna put our wreath up here. I got a couple things of fairy lights from Target. They were like five bucks and I might try and like string them through there and see if we can make it work. strand of twinkle lights we're gonna try it out they're honestly so pretty and I love how they twinkle and I think that you can put it on yes you can you can put these on timer mode so that every four hours I believe they will start twinkling and then if I like want it to be lit up at night I can walk out here and switch it to on I'm gonna hang the battery pack on the hook so that I have easy access to it and I can turn it on, off, or just put it on the timer whenever I want to. It's gonna look so pretty. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. 
over here is try and wrap lights around our pillars. I think it would look really pretty to have all these pillars lit up. So I'm gonna try and hang some lights on there. I'm racing the sun. The sun is going down very quickly. It's only like four o'clock, but I think I only have like 30 minutes. So we'll see if I get it done in time. And if not, we might have to come back tomorrow morning. On the door, jingled once more. And then time almost came to a stop But somehow I knew It's pretty dark, but I got the lights up. They look great, and I have one other just really fun thing that I want to throw out here, and I'm actually gonna surprise you. So I'm gonna do it real quick, and then stay tuned for the final reveal. This looks so gorgeous, you guys. Christmas. 